Hello everyone. In this video, we will talk about HTTP protocol. What is this protocol and why do we use it? So, HTTP protocol is developed on layers, layer 7 of OSI model. That is the layer which is uh, which is uh, exposed to the end user so basically whenever we are trying to access any uh, website on browser that is where we are directly interacting with layer 7 or application layer of OSI model and so basically HTTP is a request response protocol used to encode and transport information between client and server in an http transaction the client sends a request message to servers api endpoint and the server replies back with a response message in http 1.1 a message is a textual block of data that contains a start line, a set of headers, and an optional body. Okay, so there would be basically a set of API endpoints which would be exposed by the server, and clients would be accessing those APIs to get their desired results out of those uh, exposed API points. So, the basic methods which are exposed by or which are used by HTTP are get, put, post, and delete. HTTP is built on top of TCP, which on turn is built on top of IP. So TCP works at layer four of the uh, OSI model, and same with IP as well. And HTTP can be used to transfer data securely using HTTPS or what we call as HTTP secure. And so TCP is uh, uh, so basically there are two types of uh, protocols which deal at layer 4 that are TCP and UDP. So TCP provides the reliability guarantee but that is not same with the UDP and when uh, since HTTP is deliver, built on top of TCP we can say that our communication would be guaranteed successful and there, is, there are no chances that some packets would be missed during the communication and it's uh, kind of needless to say that we should be using https instead of plain http to trans uh, to transport our message across the network uh, http has also uh, various versions like http 1.1 and HTTP 2 and currently work is going on HTTP 3 as well so I can discuss this in more details the different versions of HTTP in the coming video so going forward uh, as I mentioned HTTP is a stateless protocol which means that everything needed by server to process a request needs to be specified within the request itself that is basically we and the a request which has been sent to the server it should not be knowing or carrying its state forward to the other uh, next request or it should not be able to it would not be able to basically get any information from the previous request and uh, so as shown in this uh, figure as you can see in HTTP 1.1, a message is a textual block of data that contains a start line, a set of headers, and optional body. Yeah, as you can see, the start line starts with this, uh, the description of what kind of method has been used. 
to access that specific URL. So that was a short description about HTTP. I hope you liked it. If you like the video, please do subscribe the channel and share it with your friends. Thank you.